Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? Hope you guys are doing good for a Thursday live stream here with the little uh, American Truck Sim. Hope you guys are doing well. Yesterday was my birthday, so we had a good, I had a good birthday yesterday. I uh, did a little bit of hanging out with the fam yesterday and that kind of stuff. But thank you guys. I want to say, uh, especially you guys that are here, and I'll say it again once we get on the flip side. Uh, but thank you guys for all the warm uh, happy birthdays here in the Discord as well. I had a few comments there and also the stream the night before. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Uh, it was good, man. Uh, you know, 26 years old, never felt so good, man. Never been more alive in my life. Uh, but anyway, it's okay. Yeah, happy late. It's all right, man. I know it ain't bringing any cake for anybody. I know, man. I'm sorry about that. What's up, C Pan? Been starting up some shout outs, man. It's good to have everybody. I'm actually kind of ready to do this. We got a little something new to show you tonight um, in the mapping. We got a brand new update on Chihuahua. So if you guys are ready to go back to Mexico, it's going to be uh, muy caliente. Sounded like a weird like soccer announcer, fo football announcer. Muy caliente. Too old to be doing this, CJ. No, I'm just kidding, man. 38, man. <laughs> 26, yeah. No. 38. c Pam, what's going on, man? Elite Braden, Chris, if you can, and Big Dog, z -Bullet, Chase Place, Mike. Good to see you, Mike. No one you know. What's up? There you go, Javon. Yes, sir. Hey, what's up, David? Oh, we'll see him tonight. <laughs> you can probably see him in the thumbnail, man. That's good, dude. It was good, man. I like him, dude. I like him. I like him. Yeah, I was, uh, you know, how, how can I make one of these look like an indie car, like an indie truck? You know, put put the tuner wheels on it. <laughs> Devin, what's going on, man? Kenny Jr., Mr. Good Time. What's up, man? Andrew M., hello, hello. Bull Holler, good to see you, man. Dirt Bike, what's up, man? Hey, thanks there, Dirt Bike. Yeah, 40, what, 40.4, 5, something like that. Dab Gaming, what's up? Uh, yeah, a lot, man. We got a lot in this profile, actually. A lot of trucks and skins and different resources and whatnot. Patrick D, what's going on, man? John, good to see you, buddy. Oh, nice, bud. Well, hey, man, I'll, I love to see pictures of it, man, when you get it done. Yeah, everybody's good, Mike. Hope you're doing good, man. Well, thank you, Happy Pants. I try, man. I try. And they got the kids in there, man, but yeah, it's all good. <laughs> What engine? Oh, you're going to like this one there, Random. You're going to like it. We'll give away a free truck tonight there, Thomas. What you say, buddy? <laughs> we actually do have a two-truck giveaway coming up. It won't be tonight, but it is coming up. I ain't more to tell you about that. So, All right. Yeah, sounds good there, Mudden. Sounds good, man. Nate Kelly. <laughs> Jake Lattiman, dear. Lattiman, dear. What's up, man? Good to see you, bud. Uh, we did a cab over last time, CJ, actually. Uh, we did the Mac F700. Uh, yeah, I hope you caught that one, man. It's awesome. Uh, actually, we're in a Cummins today. Even though it's Caterpillar on the skin, I kind of hated doing that, but I had to. You'll understand why. Anyway, let's roll this music down, man. Let's go ahead and let's get the pleasantries out of the way. We'll see you guys here on the other side of the intro. All right, there we are. I got, I got two different screens here. I was trying to trying to do a little something different there. Can you ask Shadow Walker? What up? Yes, C Pain. I don't know. Maybe it's coming. I'm not sure. Jay's, what's up? Uh, the Jake Brown, the Jake Break. Yeah, uh, it sounds all right. It, it's it's definitely it's kind of it's kind of a throwback to one three six. Honestly, it's not like one of the changed ones. Um, it, I kind of hate it. Like if I knew how to get in there and mess with the sounds, I would do it, man. Because like there's some of these. I want to change the Jake brake over to some of the other engine sounds that I know I need to get in there and learn how to like flip flop some of the sounds around. Cause I've got a couple of Jake brakes that I would put literally on every engine, <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, man, it's good. So we are in Vipers 389. We got the custom, um, uh, United logistics skin on this. I did this one uh, a while back. So we're sporting that, uh, along with John Ruda's, uh, Chrome reefer. So, uh, if you dive in exclamation trailer, That'll give you at least the Facebook link there to John Ruda's uh, website. It's $15 trailer pack. You get a flatbed, which we may look at tonight. Flatbed, and you get the reefer, and you get the Wilson uh, pace setter, which is the grain hauler. So, uh, so yeah, man, it's good. So, uh, one dub, what's up, man? Terrence could see a straight focus of photography. Oh, nice, man. You remember Brother Shane? Oh, well, nice, man. Yeah. 
Awesome deal, man. And good to see all these guys here, man. Look, Jimmy Maynard's coming in here. He's a one year plus. So it's good to have all of our uh, members in there. I was trying to see if it'll let me... Uh, let's see if it will let me... Yeah, it's not, for whatever reason, it's not letting me uh, highlight you guys. It's weird, man. I'll let me highlight y'all's uh, y'all's time here on the channel, which is weird. I don't know why it's not. I don't know, man. I'm always having issues out of this uh, Streamlabs interface. But anyway, uh, step deck. Yeah, we can we can add a step deck. And I think you're just finding out asking what I can do, what I'm not doing tonight, random. Oh. <laughs> uh, Oh, there you go, Nate. I hear you there, man. Dex Fine Assassin, what up? I hope you're doing good. Michael, hello, hello. Jason C, what's up? Thank you, man. Devious 2, what's up, buddy? Good to see you, man. Dab. Uh, <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, what's up? Wonder's in the house. What is up, Wonder? He's a year plus now, so congrats in order for those guys. Mark, he's knocking on the door, man. Nine plus. Uh, oh. Viper got taken off Steam. Ooh, so this might be the last one. I saw that it was incompatible with 138. I guess you can go in there and change. Somebody's, man, David, somebody's bound to keep up the 389, man. Somebody's got to do it, man. You know somebody's going to take it. And somebody will probably take it and try to build on it and turn it into a payware. <laughs> I do too, C-Pain. Honestly, um, I need to do, uh, I've got a plan to do a little video on this. Um, Creech has got a sounds pack that he tucked in a video that has um, like different grind sounds and different, I think it's got different break sounds. It's got a few different things in there that aren't in his normal sound pack. So I, I'm gonna actually try to get that one in, in front of a, uh, in front of an actual video and we'll see how that does. So here is our, uh, here's our special tonight. So if you're in the Discord, I would say get in there because we've got a brand new garage that just released that today. I am eventually, yes, gonna get all this stuff on Steam. I just have not done it yet. Uh, but at any rate, I've got uh, we've got this one right here. So we got uh, the Viper 389. Obviously, you can see coming into field of view here. Uh, we've got his full truck here with a long chassis. Also, we've got the Great Dane from John Ruta, which is awesome. So it is uh, very, very, very nice. Uh, I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Let's get a little uh, quick around here. Ultra Magnus. Uh, yeah, I guess, I guess maybe. Chronic Killer, what's up, man? Oh, Crony's Garage. Hello. Miguel, what's up, man? Jody, what's going on, man? It's good to see all of our uh, all our guys in there. Uh, Ryzen, Ryzen 5050-517. I've got a, a 1080 Ti. And so there it is. Butamus. Butamus. And some special wheels and tires for the trailers from a special friend on Facebook that shared a link that I had no idea what. So, <laughs> what up, Chuck? All right, y'all ready for this one? Got a body. Woo! Somebody's just going, oh. Oh, but it's so beautiful, FTJ. It's so beautiful. Yeah, thank you there, David. Appreciate it, man. Drive around. We'll show you this. Uh, we'll show you this garage. Uh, Pop-up sub should be on. Yeah, everything should be everything should be good unless Streamlabs, for whatever reason, has decided to uh, has decided to go kaput. Thank you, Jody. Yeah, the trailer sits a little low on the. Uh, unfortunately, the trailer sits a little low on the the truck, but nothing. Uh -oh. Nothing much I can do for that one. Look at that. Woo. Oh, the shifter cam? I'll turn it on here in a minute. I just wanted to use utilize the, the full the full volume here of our uh, our main screen as we pull out of the the brand new FTG garage you guys will see here in just a minute. Mm. Smexy, smexy, smexy right there, boys. I'm telling you. 
Uh oh. Wrong way. Wrong way. Let's go the other way. Yeah, let's uh let's see if we can't zoom out a little bit. Oh yeah. It's pretty good to do all that live. <laughs> Somebody asked if I was gonna take a Kenworth. Nope. That is the N14 loop. The idle loop there from Robin Icus. So yeah, it's super schmexy. <laughs> Thank you, Chuck. Let me, uh, I need to reset this chat over here. Hang on. <laughs> it's like, where's all but There it is. All right. Ah, oh, beautiful. All right. So the discord, I've got a channel in here. It's got all these links. I am eventually going to get all this stuff to the same workshop, but I wanted to release it and to make sure there wasn't anything I needed to do before I pushed it out to steam. So, um, I've gotten, I don't know, probably seven or eight, nine things in there. And these are one of them. Got 389s in there. Also, um, you'll be able to find the garages, the brand new one in there. So if you're a United Logistics driver, then get on in there and go ahead and get your garage. Start along with some miles. So Devin, all you got to do is put it above your maps, my friend. That's all you got to do. Just put it in front of your maps and you should be good to go. Just download it from the link I put in there. That's it. All right, so we'll switch to that one. There's our uh, there's our cam, so we're good to go there. All right, so we are in Chihuahua, by the way. So we're in a little corner of Mexico. So we're in Hermosillo, uh, and they're going through Yacora, and I can't remember the other one, but it's going to join up with our other Chihuahua stuff that we have seen. But tonight will be a little bit new because we have not at least been through this part of the map, which will be nice. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna find us. Um, I'll find us something here. Hopefully that is going to lead us down. If not, we're going to, um, yeah, I don't know what the heck we're going to do. Sinister, what's up? Chuck, good to see you, man. I saw Chuck up there earlier as well, so good to see you guys. Uh, it probably won't give us anything over there, to be honest with you. That's about how this normally works. Hey, I'll give you everything but what you actually really want, and that's to go that way. See, we'll go to Twin Falls, Idaho, but I just want to go a little further in Chihuahua. Nah, not in the cards there for you, bud. So what we may do is... We might just take that one and we're just going to drop it off in the core. How about that? Let's grab some fertilizer in our reefer. Because that makes perfect sense. Begin yes, it does. Navigation. Oh, thank you there, James. Appreciate it, man. Okay, we're going the right way. Oh, hang on there, car. I was kind of afraid of that. Let me uh, let me at least get out in the road here. Oh. Yeah, unfortunately, this one doesn't have a train horn on it. I didn't put the train horn on the frame, but I don't think that really matters. I don't think. <laughs> well, you go to Texas, but there ain't gonna be nothing there. Things nice. I love it. Yeah, it's got the old N14. So if you like the old N14, Jake, then yeah, you'll 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 love this one. No, we still we still good here, ain't we? Yeah, I like T800. I don't mind it. You gotta have the right one. I always think T800 feels better as a. Um, I almost, I almost feel like it feels better as a um, heavy hauler than to do anything else. Yeah, it does, David. I like it, man. I've really gotten into these like kind of custom rides. I, I never, I used to try to always find the, um, I always used to try to find the ones that were like work trucks, and then it's just like, nah, screw it, man. Let's put some big wheels on it, make some custom rides out of it. All right, uh, this is it. Sometimes you got to watch it in Mexico. They don't. 
those little turns there. I've done quite a bit of updating. All got new lamp posts are all green now. They used to they used to be just default. I agree there, Seaford. Hope you're doing good as well, my man. All right. Oh, the Mack truck was sweet. Yeah, man. Well, if you look up there, old uh, Chaos Shadow Walker's in the house tonight. There's, there's your, uh, there's your modder, man. Your modder in chief. A hey, good job with that one, man. Let's see if I got a room to swing this thing around over here. It's always hard. Yeah, I think I'm. I think I'm good. Can't never tell. Yeah, not too bad. I missed my zoom. I'm not sure exactly where my zoom was on that one. That would have helped out a little bit there. Uh, I learned how to drive a forklift. I used to. I used to. Uh, they trained me up to drive forklift on the uh, the V uh, in the boat marina. You're know, lifting the big old boats and stuff out of the water. That's what I, that's, I used to do. That. That's the only really heavy equipment I've really uh, had, including driving truck. <laughs> Sound deep. Love from India. All right, man. Well, love from North Carolina, <laughs> United States. Little old NC here. All right, so we're not going to go all the way. All right, so we're just going to use this because I want to. I want to haul something. Um, so all of this is news. All of this from here all the way down to Yukora into. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to try to say that, but anyway, all of this is all news. So I'm just going to at least get in here and unlock Yukora, and then we'll. Um, because it's 2,300 miles. We're not obviously going to do that tonight. So we'll try to pick up something here uh, in Yokora. And uh, and hopefully hopefully we can. If not, we'll switch over and do a flatbed at that point. We'll just uh, we'll keep with our same, uh, our same trailer theme here. Yeah, we'll stop and get it on the way out. About half. I definitely don't want to make this trip with uh, low fuel. <laughs> Oh, I know I got it, yeah, but it takes forever on these roads, man. These roads are no joke. Absolutely no joke. And I'm actually going to set myself up a little bit. Well, that's pretty, that's, yeah, that's probably bad, good. Turn right. see um, all right so we got gas looks like we've got right across the interstate there Ooh, a twins a twin stick setup that would be nice cronies I, I think we kind of figured out how we could do it I just don't have twins of these <laughs> Maybe like a two hundred. I would like a four hundred dollar shifter for twin sticks. <laughs> I don't. I don't. Yeah, I don't know if I could swing that one, man. Yeah, the wife said I was okay with one, but I don't know two. <laughs> I don't know. We might be pushing our luck, but. <laughs> All 
All right, let's go ahead and let's fill her up. And uh, we've already hit the road, man. We got a lot of good stuff, man. So a lot of um, a lot of this you'll find here in this Chihuahua section. It's kind of Mexico uh, extremo ish. Um, but it's not really, uh, it's not really what you'd call like extreme, like mountain traversal roads. There's some, there's some pretty cool places down South, but this one's, this one's still all roadway. So we still should be able to get through it pretty nice, but it's really pretty. So you guys will get a nice, a nice scene and I'll get, I'll get outside and I'll get inside the truck and, uh, give, let you see a little bit of both. What's up there, Timbo? Good to see you, man. Mike Brown. What's up, man? More of a stock truck instead of a custom. Why? Wow. I actually argued with a guy one time that argued that NASCAR stock cars were stock. They weren't fixed up and souped up. He argued that actually. I was like, what? Wait, what, what, wait, what? What do you mean they're not? He said, they're stock cars. That's why they freaking call them stock cars, man. Okay. <laughs> Nothing gets by you, does it? <laughs> hey, Adam Little, man. I happen to be looking up. Thank you there, man. Appreciate that. Another first gear member. Appreciate that, man. If any of you other guys want to join the uh, join the squad, so to speak. Um, a, uh, it's $4.99 is our entry level, our first gear. And it just comes out monthly. Uh, it's kind of like a $5 super chat. It's a great way to join. Great way to... Uh, it's a great way to support the channel and stuff like that. So thank you there, man. Appreciate that, Adam. Awesome, man. Yeah, I don't know how you do that, though, Cecil. I said my handbrake's a sequential shifter, but I don't know why you would... I don't know how you do that. Like, what would be the point of it? You know what I mean? Yeah, there it is. Thank you there, Adam. Appreciate that again, man. All right, so we're uh, on our way. See if my camera behaves a little bit better today. Looks like it's doing a little bit better so far. something I am going to do. Let's do this. Let's do um, let's teach you guys a little Hey, Sir Kales! <laughs> Making them drop. Thank you, man. What's up there, Sir Kales? Thank you there. $20 super chat, man. Appreciate that, Bo. Alright, let's do G traffic. I'm going to do this on a uh, .02 which means traffic's going to run at .2 less than one so we should have a uh, uh, considerable less traffic through this road which will be y'all will thank me later and they go they go too slow oh got you Seifer. ah uh, that's the only three options they gave me unfortunately oh yeah 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 joey i, I mean i drive you know anything that comes out man I'm all about it, man. What's up there, J-Cab? Thank you, man. Uh, what's up, Donovan? Uh, we're just hauling something here in the Reefer. Um, I'm not even sure what we are. It's got a lot of... We're just going to mainly do this next road here, so we'll wind up chunking this uh, wind up chunking this one away here pretty soon. I just wanted to get it out, at least put a load on it, get it out on the road instead of hauling an empty trailer. You know what I'm saying? It just looks a little weird, man, when you do that. You just couldn't do it? We drive those European trucks. <laughs> I figured you wouldn't have a problem with some rubber bands on some American trucks. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, man! Uh, it's a modded account. Yeah, like I, I just I mod these like left and right, man. If I've got one of these, I've got 20 of them sitting on my desktop. <laughs> I have to, man. 
And you know, telling how many times I grab mods and, and they wind up screwing profiles up, or they don't work, or there's something obscure somebody doesn't do right, and then I've got to wind up coming back in and completely redo it. And then I'll just have to set up a whole new profile right before stream. It's quite happened quite a few times. He seems to. Yeah, Dark Trick, yeah, Robin Igus is in 14 uh, custom idle loop. Loop. Not loop, sorry. So this is all Steam Workshop, by the way, as well. So if you want to, if you want to, oop, speed bump. <laughs> uh, yeah, we probably would have popped all six, seven, eight tires there. Yeah, probably would have done it with that one. I always forget Mexico's got these speed bumps. We're not going to buy, buy them too much, man. I want you guys to see this map as much as you can. Be good stuff. We're doing that tomorrow, Mr. Uh... Yeah, no ragu. And we're doing that tomorrow. ETS will be tomorrow night. So if you guys want to, uh, if you guys want to come up and hang out with us, we will be having that one going Friday. Uh, so please, ETS two, if you got it, and it's on fix and go on sales, summer spring sales, like all of that stuff is happening right now. So make sure you don't miss out on that stuff. Grab ETS, ETS, that stuff is gonna go on sale. Make sure you're looking out for it. And that way you'll be able to participate in the convoys with us if you want to. So make sure you go, because uh, we'll be going tomorrow, uh, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Same, same. We'll uh, put everything up in the Discord. Same thing for Saturday. ATS will be on 137 multiplayer. Uh, we'll be dealing with the sounds the best we can, but uh, still still doing a convoy with everybody. So uh, type, put an exclamation in front of it there, Joe. Exclamation trailer. Alex the Dump Truck, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, Brian? Uh, well, probably not too high. I guess we did all right on that last one. <laughs> what you mean? Uh, what you mean to the passenger GVS? What you mean there, uh, Sir Gales? Oh, oh, yeah, I know what you mean. I have not dab gaming. I think they've been pre they've basically been completely silent, man. I have no idea. I have no idea, man. Uh, Papa Tango, no, this is back on 137. I did to go back just for maps and for everything else just to make sure. Because I did, couldn't drive, uh, right now at least anyway, I couldn't drive Vipers on this. So, so yeah, man. Uh, this engine's got a 650 in it there, Elite. And you know what I'm, I'm loving about the, uh, the Reforma maps and stuff, which is the Mexico guys. These guys are killing the way the landscaping and the road meshes with it. Um, where most of all your turns are all cambered the right way. They're not cambered inside or outside, you know what I'm saying? So it's actually uh, extremely enjoyable. These guys are killing it, man. Make sure. Okay, made sure I didn't wanna, yeah, miss that turn there. Uh, Naze. Is that Alex? It's Alex. Should change your profile picture. Yeah. What's up, Ace? Good to see you, man. Uh, Evan, I'm good, man. Hope you're doing well. Thank you there, Mr. Sidhu. So this is the N14, the uh, the lope. So this is kind of like the original, like if you guys remember, like the original, um, what you call it, the original um, 
in 14 sounds from like 136, like pre F mod. Yeah, this is it. <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. What's up, Darren? Good to see you, man. Geek Squad, what's up? See what I mean here? So, like, see all the curves and stuff are all, they're all cambered, right? I mean, it's basically if you're turning left, you don't want the camber of the land to take you to the right and you just tip the truck over. So, I think it's pretty cool, man. They had this in there. Super, super nice. It's nice, flowy. Like, this whole entire road is like this. It's just crazy, crazy killer, little kind of, you know, I don't know what you'd really call this. Not really mountainous. I mean, I guess it is mountainous, but it's just, it's just same rolling hills back and forth. Nice hill climbs, nice downhills in this. And this is free, so if you go down to Team Reforma, just type in Team Reforma in your Google bar. Type in Sierra Nevada or Viva Mexico. Uh, grab their website. Now, this part of it, uh, the Chihuahua map, is not free. I think it's like five bucks. Uh, and that gets you early access because it's still in beta. But once it's out of beta, then it'll be free. So if you want to wait on it, bookmark it, uh, do it. Hey, it's mountains. Hey. Oh, I didn't even have my windows rolled down, fellas. Holy crap. Yeah, Dav. <laughs> Where y'all being, man? Y'all been sleeping on me. But I'm not doing my job. I'm not doing my uh, job well enough. Hang on, I have to. Uh, I have to see one thing here to make sure that these these uh, these aren't too loud. Make sure my my sound bar up here is not screaming at you guys. Oh yeah, she's screaming. <laughs> she's screaming. Kona, thank you, man. Oh, it's nice, man. Kona, a boy in nice first gear member there. Appreciate it, man. Sound a good level sound wise? All right, man. Maybe it's just really loud in my ears. <laughs> I feel like I'm screaming over here. Hang on, guys. Can't talk to you. Let me roll the windows up. All right, now that's better. Yeah, thank you there. Viper get update. Well, I don't know. Viper's been updated for a while. Uh, I'm in 137. Uh, the windows have always rolled down for me, so uh, um, I don't know. Hey, what's going on, Jacoby? Yeah, it's going to be quieter outside here when you're like way back behind the. I wish they uh, at least added in so uh, I think the the engine sounds on the outside just need to be louder. They need to match what's going on in the interior so the wind sounds and like everything need to like, you know, come with it. It gets a little bit louder when you get down here but, you know, who can drive like that very long? Yeah, we're not going all the way down there. But I, I was talking about that you must have just been a little bit late, Donovan. We're not going all the way down there. We'll go to your core, pull this one to your core, and we'll uh, we'll fire something else off in the flatbed from John Ruda. We'll uh, we'll pull something else. What's going on, Mr. Adam? Hope you're doing well, man. Derek, I'm good, man. Hope you're doing well. Um, no, yeah, Vi well, I don't know if Viper updated himself, but it is updated from the Steam Workshop because I don't have another one. 
So it's possible. But I figure afterwards, man, people will, people will probably put some updates out there, you know, on the mod site. So you'll probably eventually have to download. Um, you'll eventually have to download his truck. It's a good thing we're not seeing any traffic on this road. It's one of those roads you probably don't want to have too much traffic on. Uh, yes, I increase engine brake. Uh, no, uh, Devious, if you hit, you can assign it via the plus and the minus. Um, actually, I've got this one set on the retarder, uh, this one, but if I wanted to, this one actually has retarder on it, but if I want to change that to the engine brake, I could. But I just have it set to plus and minus on the keyboard, so um, if I flip the engine brake, see how quiet it is? And then here's one level up. And there's two levels up and so it's it gets it gets louder and gets a little bit more forceful the more you put on it but yeah man uh, do I know when what's going to update Oh, you're talking about yeah. You can only oh, so you're saying you can only get it in uh, you can only get it on the on the uh, mod sites. You talking about 389? The uh, SCS is 389. I think that's what you're talking about. I think. What's going on, man? I'm chassis with it. It's just a long lowered, long lowered six by four. Hey, Peter. Yeah, man, I did. Thank you, man. Everybody thinks I'm on the Optimus Prime. Little, it's a little blue for Optimus, though, ain't it? Okay, Devious. Well, if you want to hop into the Discord one night, I'll, I'll help you out, man. It is tricky. They don't do a very good job of telling you what programs or anything that you need to use. Yeah, yeah. So that's going to be, yeah. The wheels and tires are the Alcoa, uh, the big Alcoa mod pack. 2.0. It's on about every single mod site you can possibly get. Yeah, so unless we, uh, you know, unless you already had uh, Vipers mod, uh, that it's no longer in the Steam Workshop now, so you'll have to, uh, you'll have to grab this one off the, the, uh, the mod sites unless someone like does hotfix updates for it. It's about the best we can know for at this point. The Sean from Jamega Mod, what's up? Joe, thank you, man. Appreciate it. Chronic, what's going on, man? Thank you, there, Merc. Game, appreciate it, man. Uh, POV Culture, I use a, um, a 1080 Ti. Zoe's thinking pretty through here, man. I hate to get stranded out here, man. This would just, oof, this would suck. Be terrible. Well, I'm sure people will. Here's the thing that I. Here's the thing that'll suck. Uh, if it's on Facebook. Depending on who it is, uh, you got to watch them taking all of the parts and files and making it their own truck, and then trying to create either a private truck that everybody will drool over, um, or uh, they'll they'll maybe update some stuff. But I don't know. Usually, when guys on Facebook get stuff, it usually either completely goes away, uh, or they fizzle out with it and they don't keep it up. 
or that turns payware, which completely could could completely be possible if he abandons the mod. If he abandons the mod, then there's really not much that really anybody can. Whoa, 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 whoa. Didn't, I didn't like that. Didn't like that. Ah, uh, Burke, no, I'm in, uh, we're still in, uh, I'm on 137 right now. I went back. I'll put a drop axle when you guys stop asking me to put a drop axle on there. Thank you there, Colin. Yeah, I, I, I like it too, man. I decided to go a little, you know, I've been in the blue kick, man. We did a little aqua marine-ish, aqua blue for our Mac F Summit uh, 700, and then I did this one, and we had like a more uh, more stately blue for that, uh, the Peterbilt uh, 389 from Bruda. We did a couple about a week ago, so yeah, I've been on a little bit of a blue kick. Well, I don't have the Freightliner that smokes in the stacks. So uh, if you know what that is, uh, somebody's either going to have to tell me who to buy it from or who to contact uh, or who to get it from. Hey, what's up, Michael? It was good, man. Just kind of hung out here with the fam and uh, got on here a little bit too late last night to really open up a stream. So, but yeah, man, it was good. Well, you'll have to, you'll have to let me know which one it is. The only two Freightliners that I know that are worth downloading um, are, uh, are Jess's and his is Payware and John Ruda's. Uh, yeah, you can't post a link in here. You'd have to just throw it to me there on Discord if you wanted to. Second. There we go. We'll get way back here. Oh, yeah. There we go. Hey, y'all can really see. I got like <laughs> to draw so much map in now it might not run that smooth. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> David, dude. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, man. When I first saw the Roland uh, 389... Uh-oh. When I first saw the Roland 389, that's what I thought it did. I thought he stole parts off of other stuff. I was like, ain't away this full sell this truck for 100 bucks. Yeah, we didn't need that sign, man. It's all right. There ain't nobody on the road, man. We're the only ones out here. I'm trying to draw so much map in. It's kind of like... <laughs> Let's get a, we'll get a little closer. Might help. I might go ahead. This is getting like... This is getting a little crazy up in here. We're drawing so much. I'm going to back her down one. <laughs> Oh, I did have it. Oh, shoot. Well, that's why. Let's let's go back. Yeah, I'll, I'll put it back on here. Yeah, every now and again, man, boy, you throw, throw this Mexico stuff at a man. It, uh, now, this is just one of the... This is that... Um, shoot, man, I can't even think what they call this mod. Um, it's... Uh, somebody in chat can probably help me. Um I can't remember what they call it, man. I think Sissel did this one, SISL. I think he did this one. Yeah, well, it was lagging because I had all of my stuff jacked way, way too high for all of this mod plus the map. I was drawing way too much map in there because I basically was running under no boundary, so you good now. <laughs> CW, this is the uh, Vipers 3D9. Oh, I guarantee you they drive trucks on here, Frost. I guarantee you they drive trucks on here. What about bet your money they do? Uh, what's up, Mr. Bueno? I do not have. Uh, I only bought one, man. Jess never reached out to me to, to push it on YouTube, so I didn't buy it. Um, not really because I didn't want it. I just didn't. I already had one Freightliner, and I didn't feel like I needed another one. 
Mr. Asani. What's going on? Swerving Irvin. That's right. Tamir, what's up? I would shout, but everybody else might get mad and stream if I shout. I typically try not to do that. Uh, how much you pay for it? For which one? There, Frost. Man, it's already 450. Good gravy. Stale, what's up? Thank you there, Jeff. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, I like a little Viper. I'll have the old school, man. I don't like I don't like any of the new the new 389 stuff. Like I could care less for that stuff. But you can show me uh, you can show me to the uh, show me the garage, man. If you got an old Dash 389, oh my gosh, that's what I used to love about uh, Outlaws 389. truck? What you mean a caterpillar truck? Like an actual cat truck? What you mean like a caterpillar engine? What's up Antoine? Don't worry man. Connor, I don't know. We usually go about that between an hour and a half and two hours. Depends on how uh, how good of a night it is. How good the ride is. It can be. Good to see you, man. Yeah, there it is, the route advisor. That's it, man. Thank you there, Connor. Ten dollars super chat there to throw that one out there. The new 389s. Hey, look at there, there's the truck. New 389s, drive line and vibration issues. Well, I was mainly just talking about the mods. <laughs> well, I, I like the old dash ones, man. They're 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 my fave. Uh, I can goof, uh, but I don't. I, I I haven't driven from that. So many people asked about it. Uh, not to mention they, uh, some of them wish I'd take it down so that way they could see more of the trucks. So I was like, yeah, all right, whatever. Merck, we are in, uh, we are in Mexico. Fixing it up to the new area there. Danny, the stream fan, appreciate it, Danny. <laughs> you can't see the gauges, yeah. I know, I go nuts when I can't tell what gear I'm in. Like I know what I know if I'm in seven, but I can't remember if I'm in low or high because I don't have my shifter top yet, which I actually got some uh, some pictures from today. I might give y'all a sneak peek at the end of it. No, I don't know. Let's see. Oh yeah, yeah. What's going on, Brian? I'm good, man. Adam, I just modded it in. I've got a ton of these modded profiles laid around, buddy. I use them all the time, man. I have to rebuild profiles quite frequently, so look at this. You're not going to have to take a run around here, man. Sit up a little bit 
further in the seat. Yeah. Thank you there, Danny. Appreciate the sub. Yeah, it gets a little worse, actually. This is kind of like the chill part of it. Yeah, I don't use cheat engine. I just use the TSS heat tool and it takes me about two minutes to do it. That cheat engine, man, I never really... Yeah, the using the TSS heat tool allows you to just find it in every garage. It allows you to upgrade every single garage, discover every city in the game, name your start locations, you know, salvage off your trucks and copy them and all kinds of, all kinds of great stuff, man. A little sweet bump there. Boop, 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 boop. I have tried truck. Yeah, I use it, but I just don't use it on single player. I just have it disabled for uh, for single player stuff. So reset that thing. It's good stuff, man. Look at that. I was wondering where that green tin on the top of my roof was coming from. It's coming from the uh, the lights up there, man. Look at that. That's pretty legit right there. Very nice. Yeah, a little speed bump, Andrew. Just a little boop, 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 boop. That's all, man. I know it says I'm only doing 30, but by gosh, man, it feels like we're going faster than that, don't it? Yeah, Chris, uh, I'll, 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 uh, I got some, some pictures of at least the top part put together. I'm having a whole new, the guy's doing a whole new shaft on it too. He's doing a carbon fiber shaft tube. Hey, Ace of Spades, here's $10. Thank you there, Ace. Appreciate you, man. Grant's there to Ace because he's a uh, recent graduate of COVID-19 2020. <laughs> yeah, so he's... Uh, I think he's fixing it in list too, so whoops. An early thank you to his service uh, and, and I guess coming service in the military as well. So thank you there, Ace. Appreciate you, bud. Ah. Let's try that again. Grabbed out a little too early. Uh, J Cap, this one's uh, 15. You get three. You get this one. You get a flatbed, and you get the Wilson's. Uh, you get the Wilson uh, grain hauler, the pace setter. You get all three of those for uh, 15 bucks, man. Pretty good deal if you ask me. Just don't know, man. I just don't know if that little thatch fence there is going to keep us in the road. <laughs> I don't know. We are running the Cummins there, Hillmax. We got the N14 low bottom. You can't hear the low bottom because we haven't stopped yet. But we are in the uh, we are we are burning the roads up in Mexico tonight in the brand new Chihuahua update. So nice, uh, nice Viper 389 reefer combo here. It's kind of like the classic man. We get a little dark on us, uh, but we're getting almost ready to get to Yukora. That's actually where I'm going to stop this one. And you guys can either decide whether or not we try to pick. We'll see if we can pick up a reefer load and continue going. If we can, we can. If not, then uh, we can we can go pick up the flatbed. So I might be able to do that.
Those cones are not run overable. Is that a thing? Run overable? Okay, okay, go this way. Alright, we'll have to. Again, I got a new watch. And I'm sporting that, and I got a new cam. So we got a new camera, so we got a we got a nice Sony camera and a couple uh, got two lenses with it. So uh, it's one of those is going to replace the GoPro, and we may eventually uh, get back into doing some three screen stuff with a brand new cam. So um, but, you know, if anything, I also bought that too, so I could do more setup vids, and it'd be a little bit more legit. I mean, honestly, that's, I mean, that's really the one thing. That way I can sit in front of it and, and have uh, really nice ambience in here and uh, do, do my best on that front. But, but yeah, it's, uh, it was about time I needed to replace. I've had that GoPro for a long time, so decided it was best to go ahead and grab one up now. So, yeah, it's good, man. I actually have been a Canon guy my whole life. And uh, my church, we use a lot of Black Magic broadcast studio stuff. Um, obviously, that's not really something you necessarily want for your, uh, want or need for your uh, streaming needs. Uh, but Sony, man, they came with a lot of really good reviews on on uh, on some of these different stream sites and things that I'm a part of. And people really liked them, so pretty cool. Yeah, man, it was good, but it was good, man. It's got a like, family. I was gonna try to stream, but uh, last night, but we just didn't. I just didn't get back and get back and get everything up in time. You know, I was like, I got nothing to stream. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Where are we going to go? Where are we going to do? Nah, it is what it is. John James, what up, buddy? How are you, man? <laughs> Black Magic Church. <laughs> Black Magic Cameras. <laughs> uh, ironically, yes, that's what they call them. That's the brand. It's Black Magic. And it's funny. It's one of the most like sought after cameras for a lot of church live stream stuff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's that Black Magic up in there. Yeah. It's one step away from the Rattlers. <laughs> Uh, but we're not too far from Yukora. That's where we're actually stopping. So don't let the uh, thousand miles, don't let that get you. It just takes a while to, to run some of these roads. truck is free the trailer's not their truck driver uh, of course now the truck is out of the steam store so unless you had it before you can't get it now he has officially taken it out of the steam store which is honestly kind of crazy because i think when i came in ats it was 1.26 that's when i started 
1.28 was the big update, but I remember 1.26 and 7 is when I first, and I think 1.28 was when I first found out about the 389, the, uh, the Vipers 389, so been around for quite some time, man, and dude has kept this truck up for a long time, so says he's going to he's gonna run off and he's going to do some other things, so I'm actually anxious to see what he does, man. He did this for the Viper, I'd be excited to see what he uh, takes off next, man, if Know, it might be good. You might be like, oh my god, man, freaking get rid of Vipers, man. Let's get this truck in here. It's awesome. It's a long way down there, folks. A long way down there. Emil, what's up? Yeah, Josh, no problem, man. I'll just get through some of these little crazy roads here, and we'll uh, we'll drop out there. She blows. Uh, so Sicko, the uh, the sound is the N14 um, N14 Lope Idol from uh, Robin Icus. Yeah, your choices, your guesses are him or Creech. Yeah, those two are the only two guys that really do, like, legitimate, like, you know, legitimate sounds. Oh, that's what David was talking about, the SES forums. You only get it from SES forums, not the actual workshop. Yeah, okay. Okay, I'm with you now, man. <laughs> I just was like, what is he talking about, SES? I guess SES don't make this truck. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> <sighs> oh, we actually have a car in here. Thank you there, Emil. Appreciate it, man. I try, man. It's uh, it's been uh, it's been pretty good here. We've actually had some nice updates for you know, you know for ATS and and honestly, we you know obviously we've got Idaho shortly, hopefully on the realm. I don't know when that's going to pop through, but um, you know we're looking for that one to kind of bounce through here any minute. I mean. 138 should probably be your tall tale sign that that one's gonna that one's gonna be the the DLC that's coming. Truck wise, we're looking at two Freightliner Cascaded, the older fleet version, and also the Western Star. Um, I'm not sure which model of Western Star. I would assume probably one of the newer ones, like the fleet Western Stars. Um, you know, I wouldn't expect anything like super old and you know. Oh, I hope they put in the 1974. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I, I, it'll probably be. I want to say plain Jane, but it'll be something that was probably widely produced, something that's very recognizable. Um, that's typically their their MO pattern when it comes to trucks, uh, rather than put the obscure stuff in there. But anyway, 
Um, so that's got a couple of things going on. So, I mean, it's been pretty busy around ATS here lately, which has been great. ETS, if you're a fan of that, we've got ETS uh, Iberian Peninsula is probably shortly on the release as well. Probably as soon as the kind of the pizzazz off of Idaho wears off, which probably will take us about two days to drive through at best. Um, and then we'll, uh, I would venture to say that at ETS or SES, we'll probably start releasing or at least looking at the release of uh, the Iberian Peninsula, which is Spain and Portugal. So that's going to be coming up as well. So um, it's quite a, quite a few things going on that we uh, we hopefully will get to be able to participate in on both sims, which is always always good. We've kind of had these tandem releases with with different things. We always either get um, we we'll always either get one, and then the other one will come in a little bit later, um, or they either release about almost at the same time. Just kind of funny, but. Uh, yeah, Devious, I'm still Great America, and we're uh, right now we're in uh, Mexico. But yeah, I'm still I still got it in, man. I do not have a dump truck in real life. Thank you, the Leprechaun, John Wayne. Not really, Mackenzie. It's been pretty boring, actually. <laughs> Brand new uh, Chihuahua maps. You guys are interested in the mapping on this? Uh, just type in Team Reforma, like Reforma. Just reform with an A on the end. Those guys are uh, those guys are uh, doing really, really, really incredible work. Incredible, incredible work. All right, I might have to get in the cab on these. Just give me a minute. Actually, I can actually see the um, that logging road there is getting close. So once we get to Yukora, we'll pull over. We'll uh, snap the, uh, the the flatbed to us. And we'll see if we can't pick up a flatbed load out of Yukora, which would be nice. Thank you, Merc. Appreciate it, man. Um, I can get around. I was going to try to do... Well, now, let's see. John Ruda's... Oh, the classic. I want to do the top, man. I want to do the, the stand-up reefer. That's the one I haven't done. Not the stand-up reefer. Oh, my gosh. The stand-up classic. I did the flat top, but I wanted to also add the other one in there, and I just haven't got around to it. Go ahead there, Sigo. Sergeant Tex, N14, Lope Idol by Robin Ica's Steam Workshop. Just type in N14. There's two of them. Hit subscribe and add them to your mods. Yeah. Oh, nice, John Wayne. Yes, yeah, that's pretty much you, you pretty much have to discover the places that you grab jobs from so you have to discover a city before it'll allow you to do a job out of that city so you either have to fast travel to it and discover it or drive on a road or you have to you know discover it as you're driving through and then you can grab it in later The TSSE tool, you probably have to Google that. That's the only way to discover all the cities. Um, there's really no way to discover all the cities if you're going to start up a new account, that kind of thing, or start up a new profile. Essentially, I think is what you're talking about.
All right, so uh, go ahead and let's chunk a few people. Um, if I don't answer your question, I'm not really interested in answering it at all. Uh, and then there's a time where it's pretty much just being a troll. That's all it is. And I actually know who you are, so be lucky if you're in the next convoy either. It gets on my nerves. I mean, get rid of you. Where's the other one? Do, 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 do. Yeah, that one right there. Okay. It happens, especially in the summer, Chris. Summer's the worst time for streamers. To be quite honest with you. Um, uh, Detroit D. Donovan, there's only a couple, man. Uh, Steam Workshop, Robin Ike's has got one, and then, um, I can't remember the other guy. Um, Z-Mods. They're only two Detroits that I know that's actually, you know, decent. Other than that, um, yeah, it's... Creech has got one, um, you gotta really be a Detroit Diesel fan to like any of them. Hey there, Paolo. Destin. What's up, Ed? Yeah, I'm not sure what you mean by the big lug nut covers because I've got the six inches on the wheels right now. Yeah, it's weird questions, man. Weird questions. Y'all were, were super spicy tonight. Yeah, I agree, I agree with that, Chris, man. Yeah, it, it's legit, man. His stuff is legit. I might just have to point some new mods, man. I have to keep pausing and keep the lid them out. Oh yeah, I'd drive one if they uh, if they gave it to me. <laughs> I mean, honestly, man, if it, if it if it's your if it's your livelihood and that's what you're working on, man, and then that's that's your thing. You know what I'm saying? That's it. It's all it's all good at that point. It's all good at that point. Uh, yeah, you can happy, or you can use GIMP. I mean, I use GIMP. I had both, but honestly, I don't pay any more for the Photoshop uh, licensing because they're their monthly stuff. I don't have to. Because I've actually learned GIMP so well, man, that it's just kind of like, it's kind of like the, I, don't, I don't want to say I know it like the back of my hand, but I know it really well. I know how to do all the things that I need to know how to do on it, you know? So it's just kind of like, no, no real point in actually going to do all the, the, um, the all the pro mod stuff. So Andrew, you've asked that question about five times tonight, and I answered that question about ten times two days ago, and uh, that answer still hasn't changed from two days ago. I just don't know how many more times I can answer that. I'll get it when I get it. Um, I've gotten pictures, and the guy sent me updates today, and I can't know no worries with it man it's going to be um it's going to be awesome um 
So yeah, I'm not I'm not worried about it. You guys keep texting like I'm getting stolen from my money. Trust me, I'm not. Cause I had to ship it to the guy, so I know where he lives. <laughs> Might be a long drive, but I know where he lives. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and let's fill up here. And then we will, uh, let's go ahead and let's dump the reefer. Well, I'll give you guys a choice. You guys can do whatever. We'll dump this one here. And, um, uh, we'll go ahead and abandon that one there. And let's see, since we've, uh, I think we've got one more here. Let's see. <laughs> Is that it? Nope, that's not it. This would be it. Yeah. Yep. Alright, so this is the other one of Ruda's pack here. Mm, yep, that's it. Alright, let's see if there's anything out of here. Probably not. Probably won't be anything, and of course there's not. Why would there be? Let's see if there's any freight market out of here. Anything like good freight market. Hey, at this rate, I'll take some logs. Give me some logs. Oh, we do have the... Uh... Hmm. Where's this stuff going? What? Hmm. All right, so we're going to pull, we're going to deadhead up to uh, the next place. So empty, 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 empty. You can see if I've got anything that's going. Uh, yeah. Somebody was asking about, um, I like that one, but eh, it's going to be a little bit tough there. <sighs> All right, let's just dead head to the next one. All right, so there's Ruta's flatbed. Beautiful, actually. Eight. Let's go ahead and make it seven o'clock again. All right, and we're gonna go into. Let's go right here. All right, that's where we're going. That's where we're going in tonight. You like that, he man? Yeah, man. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how that happens, C-Bane. I don't know how that happens. I really don't. And let's see. I got to do one other thing here. Yeah, I can now, Devin. Uh, Gray, I have no idea about... Um... It's not bad, man. Not bad to get nine years on PC stuff, man. But honestly, if you take care of the stuff, it lasts a lot longer than people think it does. Oh yeah, sorry. I see that Timbo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It it is it is going to be a private one. It won't be a mass produced uh, shifter. And it's custom built, one of a kind, man. You won't see anything like this with any other ATS guy unless this guy builds another one. Uh, 
uh, no, I just know how to do it really fast. <laughs> I've done it uh, quite a few times in streams there, Devious. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't even want to know what kind of problems that would cause for us there, Peter. I really don't, man. Like, the concept is cool. Like, I'm thinking, like, Farm Sim. You know, where it makes it look like it's all dirty, and then you've, you know, got... You know, some of them do, like, where paint's missing on it, you know. I couldn't imagine doing the skin for, um, you know, some of these ATS trucks and then having to do all that in there. Uh, does, does one know how to turn on the cab light? So, I have no cab light in this one. This is actually white interior lights. So like, you know, you get blue and red ones and orange ones and green ones, like on special vipers. I just put it on the white one. So it looks like a cab light, but it's just white, like neons. Nothing special, man. What, like this? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's nice, yeah. Uh, it comes on with the headlights on Vipers uh, 3D9 it does Yeah, married two kids there dingo It's quite personal question there. Thank you there Louie it, man. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. The Cody, the fact that nobody has done it yet, including in payware mods, means it's probably pretty tough to do. Or SCS does not give you the ability to to actually do it. You know what I'm saying? Like they just they just it's just not it's not there. The framework for it is not there yet. God, look at this man. This is crazy. People are like, hey, could you go back to California? I'd really like to see some of the original roads of SCS. That really interests me more than all this wonderfully, uh, you know, wonderfully stacked mountains and maps you're driving through. It's kind of boring, FTG. Just kind of, you know. <laughs> Thank you there, Louie. Appreciate the $3 super emote there from one of the best. Good to see you there, Louie. Mr. 93. He's earned himself a nickname, Mr. Nine Three. Yeah, but does it move with all 18? The question is no. It's kind of like the 900A. It doesn't do it either. What's up, Mike? How are you, bud? <laughs> yes. Yes. Who's trailer? Green Boss, uh, John Ruda. We get way back here. Get way back here. Now this is hard. What's up, Rutledge? Don't worry, man. Well, five grand, I'd get you about what a mower. <laughs> the loan business is expensive, man. You have to buy a motor. Well, that'll be the size of a brand new car. How would you like to pay for that? Wait, wait, what? Yeah, it cuts stripes in your loan. <laughs> Does a lot more than cut the grass, you know. Put stripes on it's got special rollers that make you feel all good and proud about yourself maybe you'll be lucky and get one of them signs them old fancy dancy signs in the front yard to call yard of the month <laughs> oh I'm just kidding man I have to laugh about it because I'm as superficial as the next guy honey I want some stripes in the lawn you think we can get a mower that's got some stripes in the lawn <laughs> Cause you know, if we pay for the mower, it'll definitely do it. 
has nothing to do with proper fertilization and watering. You know, just need the mower, right? <laughs> yeah, sure enough. <laughs> yeah, I probably said that a time or two too, too, uh, Timbo. Uh, just the mower, man. That's all we need. Just the mower. Reseed and fertilizer. What? No. You don't need none of that. there uh oh uh oh uh oh it didn't like my track our movement there we crashed it whoops <laughs> it didn't like all that going on at the same time I shouldn't have looked up it doesn't matter all right what was that it was an hour and 30 yeah you want to see any more of that you let me know yeah i didn't like it as soon as i came back into the truck it did not like it at all <laughs> yeah uh. all right man yeah, I know. <laughs> Mike's like, yeah, see some more of that. Let me, uh, let me see where it left us off. Southern Slang, what's up, man? How are you? Yeah, no problem there, Rutledge. No problem. Oh, no, I'm just kidding, man. I am good, man. Hmm. Uh, so, uh, actually, I'm on neither. I'm a Chihuahua, which is the new beta stuff. Hey there, David. Have a good, buddy. What's up, Demarion? Let's see where we're at. We're in the. We're at least in the flatbed section. If it does it again, if we're, if it's going to pop us through. Oh, that's pretty much where it, where it, mm, yeah, it's not too far from where it happened. If it does it again, then, um, then I'll actually report that. Because it's his beta, it's totally plausible. Jersey, how are you, man? Hey, Siobhan, no, we're still back in 137. And honestly, to, to be quite honest with you, I know some people have asked me, you know, hey, does it look a lot different? Does it look a lot, you know, does it sky textures and, you know, the different different things going on, does it look a lot different? I actually think it does, um, to be quite honest with you. Um, being back here in 137 and seeing, like, the overexposed world that is ATS, um, I've always been a little bit upset. I don't want to say upset. I mean, I've just been disappointed that we just didn't have just flat. It's like there's a modifier built in all the models that, you know, makes it bright on the inside. But then when you look out, it, like, takes all the overexposure away. And for whatever reason, uh, they decided that was a great idea. So that's why everything internally in every single mod and every single SES truck is, like, white when you look out the center. When you look out the side, you see clouds. Like, why does it not look like that outside the center one? So it's just the way that they, like, make the inside of the cab brighter and 
make it look better um, and not make not make it look too dark. Um, but I noticed in the new 138 that that seems to be either toned down a little bit, especially within the, um, um, especially within, yep, it did. Look at there. It's going to do it right again. All right. So I'll have to um, save that piece of the map there because that is definitely a crash to desktop error. Interesting. All right. Well, that's uh, actually right at an hour and a half. Well, that sucks. What's up, James? How are you, man? Devious too. Thank you there, man. I uh, appreciate that. Another first gear member. I'm actually going to have to go back on stream there and do that again. No, it's not liking me. It's not. It's got anything to do with me, man. Uh, it's a beta map, so it might be an error they didn't catch before. So, um, so the thing of their DV is too. Appreciate it, man. Uh, it's nice to have a new member on the staff. So thank you there, Devious2. Appreciate it, man, as always. First gear member, so thank you. That was like three tonight. So, uh, man, guys are awesome, man. Um, don't forget, I'm not going to try to force through that again because um, I have no idea how many more there might be. Uh, the truck there, Javier, is uh, Peterbilt uh, 389 there. You have only find it on the SES forums and all the other stuff in there. So, uh, I'll thank you there, straight focused. Yeah, well, actually, we wouldn't have gone too much longer anyway. Um, just because it's, uh, you know, same truck and trailers. Um, probably, I mean, I'm trying to think here tomorrow. So don't forget ETS two tomorrow. We'll be rolling with all the guys tomorrow. ETS two convoy. I'll have everything in the official convoy. Uh, you can come check that out. And then, uh, Saturday we'll try again for some ATS. Uh, we might get maybe one, uh, at least maybe one in here. We can get maybe one convoy in before they finally go back through and, and uh, update some stuff. I don't know. Uh, if 138 starts rolling, then we'll have to wait again. Oh, it's, it is what it is. But uh, but yeah, so we'll uh, we'll try to we'll try to you know we'll try to do the best we can with convoys. The sounds are still a little off. They don't sound the best. Kind of a little bit frustrating. But hopefully they get that stuff squared away, and uh, and then we'll be back kind of in it. So Ace Driver, yeah, I'm just uh, we had a couple of crashes there with uh, um, the Mexico map. So. Uh, it happens in the same area. So I'll go back through and figure out which exactly where that's at. And then I'll let them know uh, that something's obviously going on there. But, um, but at any rate, you know, I'll, I'll do that later on. So yeah, it's good to see you, Mike. It's always good to have you back in, in town, man. Mike Brown downtown. So, uh, so yeah, it's always good to see you, man. Uh, yeah. So if, if Viper truck crashes, you may grab the latest one. Um, I don't have any problems with the truck. Now, I do have problems loading it in with a bunch of other stuff, so you have to be careful about that. So, um, oh. <laughs> thank you there, Ace. Appreciate it, man. The kitty cat. <laughs> thank you there, Ace. Appreciate it, man. $5 donation there. So, we will be on ETS2. So, if you got ETS2, go grab you some DLCs. Uh, tomorrow, we'll try to keep it in the center of the map. Uh, we'll try to keep, uh, I don't know, we'll try to keep it going maybe towards, uh, Germany going towards, I don't know, maybe we'll head towards, uh, Poland or something. I don't know, but we'll go, uh, we'll drive that, uh, tomorrow. Uh, so make sure if you want to join us, show up early. I'll have everything in official convoy ETS uh, multiplayer. Make sure you got truckers MP updated. Everything's set to go. Don't wait at the last minute. I would love to have a huge, we had a huge crowd watching and here with us last week. I'd love to have the same thing. Um, and it's no different than ATS, man. It's uh, ETS is just fine. It's awesome. Uh, the trucks sound great. Uh, still got the same good setup, and we got a bunch of good guys to do it with. And we roll on ETS. We let it. We let the big dog eat on the convoys on ETS. If you ain't got your pedal to the metal, you're being left at the gate, man. That's just how it is. So we'll have uh, Saturdays. We'll be back up uh, for ATS again, like I said. So I'll have all the info up on official convoy. In the Discord, so make sure if you want to join in those, join in the Discord. That way you know what's going on, uh, and then uh, we can go from there. So thank you guys. Appreciate it as always. A little icy tonight, but all of the good members, which you guys know who you are, thank you all for coming in, and thank you all for enjoying the stream. Uh, appreciate it. So it actually is no one, you know. It really is by leaps and bounds. But it's got about a, like, six-year head start. <laughs> so anyway, you guys, take it easy, and I will see you here tomorrow. And uh, actually... Tomorrow night. Is today Thursday? Yes. Tomorrow night. We'll see you guys. Peace out. My birthday was great there, Ace. Thanks for thanks for thanks for thanks for that. Grain balls. It's in the SES forums. You're welcome there, you know and you know. Andrew, we'll see you. Donovan, you see you. Great stream. Thank you there, Chev Siobhan. Guys. Take it easy. We'll see you. Peace.